Hello Mac Warriors, how's it going? And welcome to your daily dose of Mac Warrior Online. Today guys, it is time to play the Ice Ferret. The Ice Ferret is kind of an underdog mech, but I wanted to see what I can do with this little guy here, this little fridge, this little boxy medium mech, and I wanted to squeeze as much performance out of this as possible. Therefore, we're gonna take the Rainbow Crow, which also has a pretty nice camo pattern, and we're gonna use that specifically because it's one of the Ice Ferrets that has an ECM, and that is kind of needed, because we wanna be in the flanks of the enemies, we wanna be behind the enemies and we want to use our quite good speed of 130 kph to maneuver around unseen and shoot our heavy medium lasers into the backs and again the sides here. We have an alpha strike of 50 however if you do all of the lasers together if you shoot all of them together you will generate extra heat from ghost heat here. So if you want to be safe and if you want to maintain your dps then go for four heavy medium lasers and then one on top of it afterwards after like half a second so you won't run into that problem. Also you can see we have an active probe here and you might be like why would you have an active probe when you have an ECM because the interaction of active probes and ECM is like um, as soon as you have an ECM there the the counter the ECM counter nature of your active probe is not working anymore because PGR wants you to actively swap between uh, disrupt and counter mode on your ECM so you cannot have both of that at the same time however it helps us targeting enemies and their weak spots a bit better and uh, we have a bit of a sensor range bonus so that is good to have. It's just half a ton that we can invest and I didn't know what else to take on the mech. We don't have any other hard points. We I don't want to strip the legs down to get a full ton in order to put a double heatsink in there. I think this is fine as it is. We also got some skills here guys so let's get into that as well. And as you can see we have invested heavily into the firepower tree because I wanted to get as much heat gen, as much cooldown and as much laser duration as possible. Or let's say as little laser duration as possible therefore we're gonna take those nodes. Uh, other than that, bit of range on the way down and uh, yeah this is just it. The thing about the heavy lasers is that they have a quite heavy la laser duration. It's quite long and the cooldown is also quite long so I think you actually need that in order to make it work. We also got a bit of survivability here but those are just some leftover points. I wanted to get some additional armor hardening and a bit of skeletal density. What's more important is maximum cool run, maximum heat containment and of course the ECM nodes otherwise our ECM would be kind of worthless. We also have a UAV plus a double cool shot build on the auxiliary tree and that's the whole build guys i hope you enjoyed the video and i hope you enjoyed the two games that are coming now if you have that as always don't forget to leave a rating subscribe to the channel if you haven't already also if you want to support the channel there's a link down below in the description that leads you directly to my patreon page but now it's time to hit the battlefield all right first game of the day we are playing domination on the hibernal rift and i do believe i want to go around the charlie 3 area i want to go around uh, delta 2 area and maybe we can go in the backs of our enemies so let's see it's quite a wide circle that we have to take but we are running 130 kph so let's see if that's possible also heat build up check yeah, if you shoot it like that, we are at 45% heat. Good to know. So, watching this here, because enemies might come from this area already, but I want to go down here. I want to take the long route, because if I pop up there, then uh, enemies will most likely see me. And I want to stay in the trenches in order to get behind the enemies. Um, let's see if that's possible or not. So, take that route. Oh, there is a, there's a freaking mad cat. Hello. Ooh, that's a problem. Okay. Yeah, hello. I'm gonna get out of here, right? I will. I'm gonna try at the very least. And we are up on the high ground. So we have one single Mad Cat in our backs. And that single Mad Cat is gonna have a bad time because now everybody is aware and everybody is coming. And we are here with the heavy lasers to get some damage in. Let's get out of here again. Actually got hit. All right, so Mr. Oh, oh let's get out of here. <laughs> let's keep him under pressure though. There's uh, stuff coming from the other side as well. And we gotta go. At this point, at this point, we gotta... Do we? I don't know. Maybe we are not. Maybe we stay on target. Hello. Cool. And I didn't really want to drop down here. I did it anyway. I was hoping that my friends would come. But here they are, finally. So... Got some damage on that side. We, oh, that's everybody. Okay, good to know. Good to see. Where is everybody? Why is nobody coming? Hey, Cicada, what about you? Let me get out of here. I'm just running. I'm, I'm just gonna get out of this trying to get away all right yeah it's fine <laughs> oh that's everybody <laughs> that's everybody everywhere there's no safe spot holy crap why did the f guys center push now everybody is super spread we're gonna go in now ah uh, come on guys get some movement going all of the enemies are all around us we need to move in a single front in order to get a safe spot again so let's get that guy down like, where, where's everybody? I mean, we have... We have an Annie here. Annie? Annie's okay. 
Good. Push those vapor eagles, please. Uh, there's a flea in the back of Annie, but I don't let him... Uh, the heat, the heat, the heat. Do it! Stop it! It's not possible. Can we even win this here? There's so much confusion on the battlefield. So much of it. Alright, let's go down here. Let's take that vapor eagle. Try to be in his back. Try to kill him. Come on. Those heavy large lasers and their freaking cooldown. Alrighty. Well. Alright. Fine. Try to stay on leg here. He's open. He's probably gonna try to get me specifically. Yeah, but I have a crazy twist speed. And we got him. So, six and four. Looking good again. Good. So, now we got some kills. Now we have less enemies that are trying to, to kill us. And that catapult is not um, targetable for me. Not at all. We're gonna stick to this guy and we're gonna orbit around him. Or maybe we wanna, we wanna help out here. Yeah, Annie, you're gonna be fine. I need to help. I need to deal damage. We have 30 damage on our laser still. There's a guy down there. We're gonna try to take the high ground because that's always good. Second too late. That was a second too late. This is a brawler. Alright, let's go. Okay. Critical. Oh, that's not good. Let's get out of here. <laughs> let's get that brawler, as I was saying. We got him. Nice. Seven and six. Looking okay. What about you there, huh? Oh, the right side of that dude needs to go. Ooh, assault mech? That was a good shot. That was a crazy game, guys. Uh, that one call for help didn't result in so much. And, um... I mean, I can understand that the Annies didn't really want to go to the sidelines there. Makes a lot of sense. Absolutely. I completely agree on that. But when you see something like that on the minimap, the, the indicator that the, the team, the enemy team is so split, then you just take all what you have in the center and just push the half of the team that is standing right in front of you with just medium max. Honestly, that, that should have happened like a million times ago. But that's fine. I mean, we're still about to win this, right? <laughs> Our Annihilator, still standing strong. He needs to save some heat, though. Um, let's see what else we got. We have an Ultra Auto Cannon 5 Blood Osp trying to go for the Mad Cat that is heavily under pressure. And I do believe on our on the other side of the battle... No, wait, never mind. That's the last guy here. Holy crap. So we got the Shadow Cat. And now it's on Annie and his friends to do something against that PPC Marauder 2C. Just keep shooting, buddy. Just keep shooting. Come on, you're gonna get him. There are so many PPCs on the board. And we are still pre-April uh, patch. So if you're watching this, still the March patch online with the crazy PPC buff nerfs, but still buffs. It's just everybody's playing PPCs today. But our confusion and the mayhem that we, uh, that we made here was actually quite helpful for the team. And in the end, we won. So let's take a look at the end score here. We got two killing blows. We got uh, eight assists, one kill, most damage dealt, 550 done, 350 taken, two components destroyed. And that was the first round. Let's go over to the next one and see how this will go down. Alrighty, second game of the day. We are playing Solar City and we are playing um, Assault. So let's go into, I would say, the right side, Delta 3. And I want to try to get behind the enemies. Maybe we can backstab somebody, dealing 50 amazing damage into their backs and then just get away because the fight will probably not go down in our favor. Let's see. We don't have really good DPS here. So again, we can only peek and poke, but peeking and poking over time still kills. So let's see. We're gonna go, yeah, down here to the right side, and uh, I really hope my enemies are not doing a counter NASCAR, because if they do, we're gonna have a bad time on the battlefield. We have somebody with us, it's an Osiris. I mean, if you wanna backstab as well, buddy, then come in my ECM bubble and we're gonna have a good time together. Let's see. Echo 4 seems clear so far. Maybe I should also take a wider circle because enemies might come around the corner and then I'm right here in open terrain, not being able to go anywhere really. But it seems like enemies are doing counter NASCAR, right? Or no, wait, they are doing NASCAR, like going around the sides. Yeah, to the right side. To the right side, seemingly. Okay, so, oh, hello. Good day, sirs. You gonna block me? I hope not. All right, here we go. There we go. Trying to juke them. Gonna shoot again. <laughs> and we are out of here. We found them, that's for sure. But uh, was it worth it? Nah, it wasn't. We took a lot of damage in that. But we also spread them up quite nicely. Holy crap. You really want to go for me? Yeah, I guess I'm just gonna completely disengage. <laughs> that was crazy. That was scary. We took 20% damage, but we split them up quite nicely. 
Yep, and that's good. Just a oh 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 oh. ECM is countered. Uh, there's somebody with an active probe here. Um, I need to go. I need to go fast. Why is my ECM down? Let me get my ECM back. Is he still on my tail? What's going on here? Why is it completely countered? Now I have it again. Whoa, that was crazy. So where is that guy? Where, there he is. Okay, found him. That ECM countered again. So I need to go. I cannot fight without my ECM. That's not possible, really. Let's see. So Wolfie. Oh, ah, UAV. UAV, of course. Let's get out of here. As I was saying, we need more people to fight with us in order to get in again. And we have it now, so let's go in again. Haha! -ha! Trebuchet with streaks. That's the thing. The the active probe. But I'm in his flank. And he doesn't know, and he's alone. But I am not. And therefore, we're gonna try to kill him now. Hey, trap. Ooh, that hurt, my friends. Kill him, kill him, kill him. Come on, can we do it? Yes, we could. Nice. That's a Gauss dude, right? I think I saw, I saw a Gauss discharge. So, let's cool down. Let's go around the corner. We should probably also take that UAV out. Although it's not really there for long. Any let's take it anyway. So, we got that. Maybe I shouldn't shot all of my weapons. Because uh, saving some heat would have been a good idea. But I think uh, the moment we come around the corner, we should be cold again. So, let's see. No, there's a guy. There are multiple guys. Hello. Goodbye. We are out of here again. Took a hit on the leg, but I think it was worth it. So, two kills already. That seems good. Just all I wanted here. Didn't want to go any further. Don't want to obstruct anymore. We're gonna wait for those guys to come around the corner. Or our guy to engage. Now we have to support him. So, if there is a if there's a fight unfolding, we should better get going and help. Mm, two and two. Not good. Cooldown is ready. Ooh, the PPCs. Lots of PPCs on the board lately. Because we are still in that crazy patch situation. Sorry for the team damage, but I couldn't see you running in there. Got that dude now. Perfect. So, artillery strike coming down. We are three and three. Let's go ahead and try to go on a flank once more. Let's see if we can find the PPC Highlander that was coming around the Fox 5 area. I hope that I'm not bumping into him. Not direct. Ah, that's what I'm talking about. Let me get out of here, please. Can we... Actually, are you afraid of me? Are you? I don't want to face tank you! Man, I cannot assess his situation here. Oh, uh, I'm panicking. I'm panicking. I need to get out of here now. Let's run. Let's run, let's run, let's run. Here's the thing. I'm gonna turn around. And I'm gonna pass him now. That Saito also needs to go. As soon as we have that, we have him cool... Uh, have his cooling down completely. Oh, what a fight! Lost a lot of my... A lot of my lasers here. Mm, I need help. I definitely need help here. I wish I had another UAV. But help is coming! Nice, we're gonna get him now. So that side also is gone. His heat management is crippled. If only I had my ECM at this point and my lasers. Man, again, the face plan was weird. Also, the game is lagging like crazy. We are down to 30 frames. What is going on here? Oh, man. So, we're still alive, but... Rest of the team is uh, is kind of dying right now, so where do we go? We are stuck. We are completely stuck, by the way. Oh my god! <laughs> so mobility and movement is a thing here. <laughs> Let's see. The wolf hunt is scouting, although he shouldn't be. He should not be doing that, man. You are down to thirty percent. That's good. We dealt some damage. This guy is killable. Wait for the cooldown. So, Panther le left side one shot. You are XL, right? Yeah, you are. Alright, let's get out of here. Woo! No, I should not. I should not. Uh, never mind. I'll, I'll take it back. I'll take it back. Okay, blood us. Blood us one shot, please. Bravo. Ooh, can we get things done here? I am... Um... Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> I'm one of the last guy. I am the last guy. Uh, now that's a brawler. We're gonna try to disengage from him. That's another guy. <laughs> Let me get out of here, please. I want to get the blood ass. Maybe we can take that kill at the very least. There he is. So, let's keep running. I'm <laughs> too much in the open. Yeah, there's another dude. Hey, Banshee, what up? Yeah. I wanted to say, what are you all about? That is where we die. 
I tried, guys. I really tried. But it wasn't enough to win the game. I think we dealt a good chunk of damage, though. So let's take a look at that. Our hit and run shenanigans actually worked out. Maybe I shouldn't have brawled with this Highlander. But honestly, it was fine. We got three killing blows, three assists. We got one kill most damage dealt with 695 damage done. With 351 taken and seven components destroyed. I call that a win, although it was a defeat. And if you enjoyed the video, guys, then don't forget to leave a rating. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye.